Hello YouTube, it is Ms. Fantastic or Kim, and this is a video response to Rob and the NGU Update Challenge. Um, first of all, Rob, I wanted to thank you so much for putting together this challenge. I have loved it. It has truly been challenging. Um, I have tried things I've never tried and pushed myself to do things I've never done, and I, I have loved every minute of the challenge. Um, my favorite was week four, the dancing challenge, because I love to dance, and that was a fun one. Um, but the challenge actually triggered, triggered um, some excellent middle work in me, and I wanted to share it with all of you, um, just in case it, it touches some of you, too. Um, this week, at the end of today, actually, or tomorrow, the people that are part of the challenge are supposed to vote on who they think completed the challenge the best. And I need to let you know, that has caused intense anxiety in me, intense anxiety, um, to the point where I have avoided doing the challenge, um, didn't want to complete week three or four because I was afraid of that, um, and so I started really questioning, what is it that's so scary? Why does that trigger this, these feelings of poor self-esteem in you? I mean, it, it triggers all sorts of stuff, like, they're not going to like me. They're not going to pick me. They're not going to vote for me. I don't want to do it. I don't want to put myself out there. I don't want to, I don't want to be a part of that. <laughs> um, so that really, really started me thinking about why my feelings about that were so intense and why am I putting up this block over that issue? Um, and it, it took me back to, you know, a hundred pounds heavier when I started this journey and my obesity and my feeling was always about my obesity and my weight is that when you're an obese woman or man in America you are invisible and that never bothered me I mean people are nasty and rude to you but that never bothered me because I didn't feel it was really me that they were being nasty and rude to they were it was a shell that was my outer shell the real me was this hurt little girl deep down inside that's covered by these this hundred extra pounds and I feel exposed now you know and I think I protected myself from that exposure and that scrutiny by putting on all that weight and now that that weight is gone I feel exposed and vulnerable and doing this challenge I love the challenge for the challenge itself. That's why I do challenges, because I like to challenge myself personally. It's never about competition for me. I don't want to compete with others. I don't want to do better than anybody else. Um, and I do a challenge because I want to beat my own personal best. Does that make sense to you? And so I've be, been really upset by the thought that at the end of this challenge, people are going to judge me and vote on me, and maybe I won't stack up and I don't want to do that I don't like that so this is nothing against you Rob I it's my own personal shit <laughs> the rest of you are awesome and you know for some people they're driven by that competitive edge I'm not but what it does for me is it tells me that this is an issue I still need to work on this for whatever reason this is triggering some psychological stuff and you know food stuff and it's all tied in together so I'm very very grateful to have this understanding and this kind of light bulb come on like maybe you need to work on this a little more Kim because you shouldn't be all psyched out over this this shouldn't be that big of a deal and the fact that I'm making it such a big deal to me says I have some work to do so I'm very grateful for that um, and I'm going to continue to do the challenge but I'm not going to post my week three because I'm putting myself out of the running I am not eligible for the vote to, so there you go I'm sorry and I know that's taking the coward's way out and that tells me something that's important to know and I think that you all out there in YouTube land will know that I'm truly healthy and have truly conquered this obesity and this weight loss journey when I do put myself out there when I do bear my or make myself vulnerable and allow that when when I take part in a contest or a competition and allow others to judge me I think will be a sign that I'm good to go but I'm not there yet I know that now so thank you Rob and um, I'll be watching all of you bye